Hello and welcome back my dear friends, it's me Odo with our uh, campaign in Europa Universalis 4 with Ethiopia. I'm not sure if we will do uh, a lot of stuff in this uh, episode as I want to consolidate a bit. Um, I want to be sure to 2.8 I'm not sure we can't eradicate these this unrest I believe I fear although a bit of the separatism should be gone now uh, 4.1 we could use two more infantry I believe a 20 stack would be great so what's this the slave trade okay one of the following must be true all of the following uh, we are the leading producer of slaves and slaves producing provinces at least four you know this could be all of the following must uh, have the modifier the abolition of slavery act less slaves producing provinces than one. Oh, okay I believe we've got the first we have a lot of slaves slave provinces we get plus 10% trade efficiency it's not best but well it's better than nothing and two mercantilism. I don't know what mercantilism does. So Akoyunlu is requesting military access from us. Accepting would allow them to move armies into our land. They are at war with Hedges and Mamluks. Weren't they allied with them? I mean Attack against Anissa in the Mamlukian conquest of Al Jauf. Hmm. It would be great if the Ottomans would attack them. Let's see. Akuyunlu will will die. This is not good. This is really not good. I mean, we're too. <coughs> they are really, really murderously strong. Normally they get kicked all around. And now look at that. Hmm. I mean, if they are at war with the Ottomans, I really want to see when they are at war with someone. Can I change my options somehow? I believe yes, but I'm not sure how it's going. Hmm. Yeah, anyway. I want to claim on this region as well. I mean they are really much at war but they still do have a lot of um, yeah hmm. Gujarat declared war on Chunagar hmm, okay okay is there some strange weather outside because um it listens a bit strange like hailstorms or something like that also we want to take Arden 
Arden would be really great to have. I'm not sure if we are able to get there. Burst of administrative fault. Most excellent news. Our country's thinkers encouraged by the open-minded stance of government. Um, what does it do? Why doesn't it show me? Or is this just an event that triggers other events? Hmm. Not sure. We will see. Oh, we need to get the legitimacy up. So, clergy is less influential. We recall this diplomat. Hmm. No, I'm always doing it wrong. Hmm. Advancement of clergy. The clergy state gains ten influence. Yeah, that's that. <laughs> Okay, where to put it to threatening countries, outraged countries, why not? Um, <coughs> we really don't want to do too much war at the time. No point 0.5, we are nearly annihilating this. This would be great because then there would be a less big re rebellion. Hmm. Let's see. There are ten thousand and seven thousand people. I mean, we can't stop them. No, they are too much. Four point nine is too much and this anyway, but uh, as this is more or less in the vicinity of my troops, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. So we'll wait until our uh, ungodly separatists in Berbera. This is also more or less in the vicinity. <laughs> 4.9 is nearly possible to eradicate that. So after the next year we will go there and try to get rid of that and this is also something that will trigger hmm. this one as well ah uh, yes that's great that's so great mm -hmm. okay we should get these two here. Because with 20,000 we are able to do even more um, suppression. The family is left behind. The recent war took a heavy toll. Ah yeah, we, kn we know this from before. Yeah, let's take the minus 20% to manpower. I'm not that keen on on warfare anyway at the moment. So we have some disloyal nobility. Oh, huh. bishop missing. What? Are you stupid? Uh -huh. 
relations improved. Hmm. What about Degapur? Why is it going up? Ah, yeah, the stability, of course. How much? 136. Ah, uh, but this is done nearly, so we'll wait until these two are ready, and only afterwards. Oh, uh, we can't do it anyway yet now. Mm -hmm. I'm so stupid. Ah, stop, 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 stop. I'd like to get a claim here. I really would like to get a claim here as well. Do we have claims on the Mamluk countries? Yeah, on Shendi, because we already have. It's a shame. We need 25 points now. Yeah, but anyway, I want to claim on this on this point. I'm not sure if I would be able to. Why is it? Oh, so yeah, stability. It's the stability. Stupid. Five point four. Consider the part of our patrimony. Yep, and the sub as well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pfft, we need more religious unity as well. We need better missionaries. Uh, come on, how long till this? Oh god, this will take forever. And yes, of course, we are doing the Red Sea to state but we won't make a core out of it okay so we don't have any advancement here yeah by network with whom are they allied? they don't have any allies anymore mm -hmm. found out that I forgot to start my <coughs> my clock uh, yeah yeah he just claimed Masava well that's okay Oof. 
we wanted to get our Jauf and they conquered land from Akuyunlu? Really? <laughs> Here's the first revolt. Yeah, anyway. How about this? This has no unrest at the time. So if this. Ah, and this is the reason why it's only 8,000 people there. Yeah, that's great. 2.8. Now we would be able to suppress this. We could probably not attack them and suppress this first. For at least one or two months. On separatists, they are yeah, they are suppressed now at seventy percent. So now we're going there, and afterwards we're going back to the other, and try to get it to zero again. Should get enough time now. Ah, oh, come on. Let's kill them. Yeah, that's okay. again mm -hmm. so now we put this down to zero uh, this will get up and this we can also put down to zero if we can do anything about that. Nope, we can't do anything about that. This will also <coughs> get out of control. Mm -hmm. to be improved. Yeah. 
Let's put this to zero, go to Bevera, put this to zero. And after that we can think about the next war. I mean this separatism will shoot anyway. And this one as well. So we can do also a war. like to get Sailor because there we have a port we could take tech we are mu very behind tech in diplomacy but I really don't want to take tech because it's really expensive at the point hmm how much does it cost? 308. Why does it cost so much now? It was less expensive before. Ah, this could be because of the stability. Could it be? Mm, but we will raise stability anyway. So, how about now? 308. Oh, it's so expensive. Nah. How about prosperity? Only 37%. Nah, we won't take the tech, but we also won't do this clicks until we have prosperity. And we will have prosperity here. Yep. So, where the. How about your unrest? Nearly gone. Mm -hmm. How many people will be there? Ten thousand, yeah, that's okay. Ten thousand is okay. We can handle them. Ah, it's more expensive, I believe, because we uh, last time we we looked, we didn't have these four provinces mm. for sure. Nah, ah, I'm always putting the wrong and subject countries nope let's go to allies oh let's look if there are possible allies of our alliance niched ah that's good that's good That's really good. I want Nedged as an ally. Perfect. Stop. Ah. We want... Okay. Oh! We have already a claim somewhere here in Mora. Hmm. I didn't know. Okay. Then we need some more. Then we need some more. How about threatening countries? Too many. Ah, yes. This is the reason why we shouldn't have done this. Because we have too many relationships. I should try to get Beja into my country. Hmm. How to do this? If we disable and do that, then we're still at over 100. 
because we enforce tradition and this will take really long to get away hmm. we could placate the ruler for 10% down but where are we now? we are now at plus 50 plus 60 plus 130 plus 140 minus 40 we are about at 105 percent liberty desire we need them to get down to 50 with one placate we get them 10 percent down but we lose i believe 20 prestige and we really need the prestige we should do a war just to just to get prestige yeah we just want to take this land and the rest just to to do prestige stuff can we do this also on Vazangali? they are allied with a Juran mm -hmm. uh, but they have still a truce with us but they don't have a truce with us yeah okay that's good so we are down to 0% in Verda that's good now up to Bevera because then we can take care of these 70% measly little uh, okay this is really really not very rather interesting stay here Consider part of our patrimony. Yeah, okay. We'll claim this. No, anyway, this country is is devastated anyway, so doesn't matter. their capital state oh Sila <gasps> they have a fort there that's great that's really great I like this fort this really will help with Tajura and everything else oh that's good this will be a nice fort Let's just improve relations with someone else at the time. Like Maha. Why not? You never know if you need it. So we have 716 diplomatic points yeah why do we only get 40% now ah no we are at 40% we have a 60% chance that we get plus 1 so we only had plus 3 in the time in this uh, really takes long we probably have to, to um, how many 
can we hold? We can only keep 1200, yeah, that's okay. Recruited Inquisitor, okay. We could recruit an Inquisitor. That's fine. That's really fine. Because this would put our... This would put our... This is a level 2 missionary guy, half price. So, if we just get rid of him. <gasps> no! This is administrative, is it? Oh, oh, oh not diplomacy. an idiot. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh God. No. Here is my missionary strength guy. This is not half price. 4.76. This is full price. This is half price. This guy is half price. National unrest minus two. Why is this? Ah, God. Ah, <sighs> uh, anyway, we probably need a not so expensive guy anyway. To get more money. Uh, will this be a problem in our war? Yeah. Means diplomatic ins insult Casus Belli on Adal. Hmm. We want to declare war on them anyway. So. This would this would get us some uh, yeah I shouldn't have clicked that away. What was that? Enforce religious unity in Malindi. A diplomat has returned from Mamluks. What? 21st March. Oh, okay. Master of Mint Alavi employed by Pete has died. What? No, by Pete. Okay. Must recruit. Ah, okay. My Mamluks has died, has died. Da, this expired. Granted, generalship has expired for nobility. Yeah, that's good. Let's grant another general. Mm, yeah, what could, pro what could possibly happen? How about the guy? That is new. Oh, two five one zero. Yeah, that's good. That's good. He's our combat guy now.
and he will move to Harare. Yeah, this is turn one, of course. He will move to Harare and no. Okay, and now we will declare war, show superiority, but we can't get any mobilists to show superiority, get bonus war score from winning battles over 10% of war score, give you a ticking war score, 100% uh, for core revocation. 100% prestige. Concession of defeat. This would get us more prestige. But I think we can't take land, but we want Sila and this is this is a good good uh, province because it has an estuary or yeah well it has a, a harbor there and therefore the trade is quite good in Silo so we want it yeah we don't need our allies anyway because they don't have any allies and they are dead just kill them. That's good. Now, first of all we'll do this, second of all these two will go there and 9,000 people, we, we, we need 9,000 people um, Why are there not 10,000 people? Did I take 10,000? Yeah, and there are the separatists. Yeah. What can you do? Stuff happens. Mm, we have this guy and he's going there. And yeah, at this point, my dear friends, I will stop for today. I hope you had fun. I hope we see each other again. See you soon. Bye.